Why, hello everyone, this is Frogsmaster595, finally a shorter Maybell video, it's crazy. Look at this prototype, got this yesterday, unboxed it yesterday, very good. But now we truly must compare it with these two produced ones. And we're not really looking at the blush, because, look, the blush is supposed to look like this, and not this, and they either did not know if they were going to do blush yet on this one, or they just didn't have time to put it on, or it faded. Let's hope it's not that it faded. Let's hope that they hadn't decided to put it on, I guess. Let's go with that. They, were, they didn't know if they were going to add blush to Country Pigs yet, so they just didn't put it. That's what I'm going with, because you know what? <laughs> Showing it one more time, they do not have the song listed there, and they don't even have a date there. But, but they got the item number, so... Maybe they had the picture for the other one done already. I don't know, but there's other things to worry about than blush. There's making sure that its belt does not get worse and the wire coming off of it. Speaking of the wire coming off, this one. I wonder if I'm going to be playing this one so I can compare it with this one and this one. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I put batteries in it. Took the batteries out of this hip hop dogs. It's Christmas time. Took out the four batteries. You see that? So there's batteries in this Maybell. And I don't know if it's going to turn on. I don't know if the wire's off already. Could have pulled off when I was holding it one time. Uh, I mean, it, it probably did actually come off because. In 2018, it came off when I did that video, right? And then it was put back on. <sighs> but I didn't ever play it again after that. I took the batteries out. But this one was used in the Frog Show. This was the Maybell used in all of the Frog Show episodes. And she was the main character. <laughs> so, because of that, there's a good chance that... Nothing's going to happen when I push this button. But the batteries are in there. Good to go. Feels right. Who knows if it'll turn on, but I got to compare it with the other ones here. But we're going to do this one first, then this one, then this one. Because here's the thing. These are both the produced ones. Their pitches are exactly the same. If this turns on, I will say this. There's no way it's going to go through the whole song. Because the wire is probably so loose on it, it's just going to fall off. And it's got brand new batteries in it. Not brand new, but... Uh, well, I guess they've been in that hip-hop dog for like a month. Still, I mean, it, it's going to be pretty fast, I would assume. Maybe not the most fast, but I guess that's good. Maybe the wire won't come off. Of course, it's going to come off. If it's not off already. I think we're safe with these two. I'm not as worried with them. I guess with this I am, but this doesn't move as fast as these two. But we should show it now. <laughs> you know, I don't even want to do a countdown with this. Let's just see if it turns on. It'll be nice to hear it again if it turns on, but let's see. Nope. It's not. That doesn't surprise me. Oh. I heard it. Well, no, that may have just been a, a piece. Um, I'm not sure. I could try moving it real quick. Let me just set that down here. Maybe, I mean, this might do something. Because my chacha slide frogs, I know the wire was really getting bad on that. But when you would, like, move it around in certain spots, it would turn on. Let's try it now. Nope. Still not?
don't want to turn on. Yeah, probably not going to turn on. That's me moving the mech around. Yeah, it shouldn't be surprising that it's not going to. Because I used it in the frog show and it. I mean, it would be turning on. I don't want it to hit the prototype. It's not going to turn on. And the batteries, oh man, if the batteries were put in wrong. There is no way I put those batteries in wrong. Um Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna look to see if I put the batteries in wrong. Alright. Well Yeah, that doesn't work. And now it's stuck in this pick position and break it it's just stuck in the position but this one sounds exactly like this one and there's a video of this one where you can see it quality is not the best but i got a video and it's never getting deleted and uh, i think i play it fully in my review of it that i did in like january 2017 so you can see that too but just know that this one sounds exactly like this one and you can just see how this one worked anyway the head moved up and down very nicely, a lot. Arms very, like, wider out, I guess. They moved a whole lot. And it just twisted, like, a lot. Very fast, very... Uh, lots of energy from this one. Just quick, crazy movement. Like... Good old classic Maybell, I guess. Crazy movement. Wire comes off so fast. I guess that's what I have to say there. But here's this one, the one I got in 2020. You've seen this one quite a few times, but we got to show it to compare it with this. So here's this one. So that's that Maybell. So you see the arms are much closer in on this one. The head still moves up and down, but it is not as much as that one. The pitch is exactly the same, at least to my knowledge. Now their hair is the same, like this one and this one. Of course, you know, like all of them, looks a little different. This one's hair looks a little bit better than this one's, I guess. This one is like, it goes longer down. This one's close. Well, no, this is quite a bit longer down, but I don't know. Uh, the colors might seem a little different. I don't know if that's the lighting or if it actually is. I, they should be the same. It's not like they're discolored anywhere on them, but... Yeah, this is very, like, shiny hair, super shiny. It's meant to be, like, a blonde, I think, but this just looks more white. Like, really? It's a white, kind of, in a way, I guess. Tags here. It's got the Walmart tag, you know, the regular Jemmy tag there. Copple, Texas, this one. Uh, it has it, but it... Again, it's super bad, right? So, and you know, everything else on this is just like this one. Bodies are like exactly the same, pretty much. I mean, all of them, it's going to be a little different, depending on the stuffing and stuff like that. But, I mean, you know this Maybell. You know how this one is. 
But it's this one we're talking about, right? I guess. I don't know. We're comparing them. So now when you look at the fronts of these, okay? When you look at these, there is quite a difference here. And it's, I guess in a way it's everything, but I don't know. Maybe not really. Because when you look at them, there's a size difference. Kind of. When you look at them from the front, it doesn't seem as much that way. Although right now their heads are kind of up. When they're down, it's a little more noticeable. <sighs> See? See, now that one looks taller. Uh, but this one's head doesn't really go that much down. I think it just goes a little more up than that. But... <laughs> um. So with the size difference, I mean, this one's head is a little bit bigger than these one's heads. If you look at the nose, there's a little more, like, lines here on the eyes, which is not, uh, yeah, it's not present there. I think the, uh, the eyes, I guess, are about in the same spot. They're not really farther out. The mouth is kind of different because... There's a difference. I think it's just that the mouth is smaller. I think that's it. It, it kind of makes it look as if the nose is different. It's not. It's just the mouth is smaller. It's The mouth is not sticking out as much. Like, you can see how much the mouth sticks out from that one's nose. I guess that one, it's not as much, actually. But this one, I guess it's similar to that one. Well, I mean, it's kind of because of where it is. I mean, no, actually, no, it's not. Okay, well, okay, there's, I guess, they kind of vary. I guess the produced Maybells vary there. But the mouth, there is still a difference from where, like, the smile is to the mouth. I, there's, eh, okay, maybe not. Still, you can see there's a difference, right? when you compare these two to this one you know what it is it's just that like this seems more round it's like much more round over here this is more like it's a little more pointier if you know what i mean especially on this one this one the mouth is really sticking out and this is still smaller the tongue is also a lot smaller that's something to bring up there you know, all these look similar to frogs' mouths, kind of. One of the reasons why I think they're similar to frogs. But then you got the movement, too. And then clothing. Somewhat, I guess. Uh, now, their outfits are the same. It's just the material is a little different. I think the pants are the same material. Well, I think it's the same material. It's just a bit of a different color, I think is all. Because I'm pretty sure that's the same material. It feels like it is. Now, the belt is definitely different material. This belt feels like most small Gemmy Items belts. You know what those feel like, right? And you can move this thing around. I think you can move it on this one. Oh, no, you can't. Okay, well, I, I don't. I think it's supposed to be loose on this one. Maybe, I, I don't know, it, I can move this around, right? I can't move it around on this one. It's stuck where it is, which is how it is on this prototype. And I'm not moving that up, because if you move that up, this stuff starts to come off of this belt. Both of these have the belts you see on other small gemmy items but this one's belt is the material that you see on a couple of the flirty flashers particularly the gorilla and the frog the girl frog their raincoats that's what material is on this it feels exactly like that which means it deteriorates real easy it's also i think the same material that's on the elvis hound dog the the trouble one, the leather there, it, that's what this is. Uh, no, no, not that one, no.
the Garfield, the Garfield's leather. Um, the, the Rock and Rebel Garfield. That's that's what this is. And that Rock and Rebel Garfield deteriorates on that really fast. But at least white doesn't pop out of that one. With this, there's actually white. And I guess that's the paint shipping. I don't know. It's a little confusing, I guess. A little bit. And I do not like touching the belt because, no, that I do not like touching it. I also don't like moving the tag too much because I'm worried it's going to come off. So let's look at the back of these now. Because this is where you can see more of a size difference. Uh, well... I guess now, not as much. Their heads still need to be a little more down. I mean, you can see it, but I think the heads need to be more down to really. Mm. I mean, yeah, you can see that there's a size difference. This one's head is just so far up now. Yeah, this one's tag is good. It's just, you can tell the way it was put on there is a little weird. But look at the hair. The hair is quite different here. It's meant to be this color, because it looks just like this on that other prototype one, the one, the picture. This hair feels different, for sure. Definitely feels different. It's actually blonde, or more of a blonde. It's not white looking. It looks better like this than it does here, I will say. But I like it here, too. I like how shiny it is on the produced ones. But this just looks really nice. And this also feels better. This does feel better than these two. This hair could have looked a lot worse. You could see there's also a color difference with the belts. Just like the jeans, how it's darker on these ones see how it's how it's that dark there dark jeans dark jeans lighter jeans these have a lighter belt because it's that different material that's shinier kind of like the hair right shinier belt shinier hair shinier belt shinier hair darker belt darker hair now they're red type shirt that's the same thing Belly button's the same. The tails are the same. The skin is the same. But yeah. Let's see more parts where the belt's deteriorated. As you've seen so much now. Because I've made so many videos on this. But yeah. There you go. You can really see that there. For a side view of them. Maybe this is where you can see the size difference. You can see it a little bit there. You can just tell how this one is definitely it's fatter. It, especially at that bottom part. It really is. It's not getting blush. I'm not putting blush on that. I'm just turning them around now so you can really look at them. You know, really get a good feel of them here. You see, I mean, you can really see... Like, the biggest difference on this thing really is that it's just, it's fatter down here. The arms are fatter. Like, the cheeks at the end here are fatter. Even the ears are a little bit fatter. I mean, everything on it is a little bigger. The nose, not really. Not the mouth. The eyes aren't, but... Hmm, no, the eyes aren't. But the arms and just down here... The feet aren't, I guess. Something else, though. I'm going to turn them this way so you can see how they look here. Okay, not sure why it stopped on me there. That was very weird. But here's the other view of them. Yeah. Look at this. You can just... This is so noticeable. Especially since there is something... The red outfit up here, the tie, way higher up on this one. This, it comes down on these ones. This one, it's like too far down. Here's the bottoms of them. 
Uh, yeah, I'm trying to show it like this. So you see, the actual base of it is the same exact size as these. Is it smaller, actually? It's smaller, isn't it? It might be. But it's just, it's so much, like, fatter, I guess, just because of the stuffing in there. It must not be the mechanism, right? Not if that's the size that it is. It's got to be stuffing. Also, if you look with the legs, how, like, much further down these ones are. Here, they're a little more down, but this one... See you see where they are? You see where that is? Look at where that is. See, with these produced Maybells, especially the Maybells, things seem to vary a lot on them. Yeah, and I'll, uh, I'll turn them so you can see it like this. Do not touch that belt. I don't like doing this, but it's for the comparison. For the comparison. Whatever, whatever you call it, I don't care. A lot of Maybell videos. That's the zip tie. It looks so new, because it is. Look at their tails. The tails are the same, right? Here you can see its sticker. Of course, the other ones aren't going to have that. And it's zip tie. Uh, yeah, it's there. It's in there. It's just kind of hard to see. And then I'll just show them from, like, where you can actually see. Right, you got that. And then you got this one. Of course, those are the same. And then... You got that one with no screw. I feel like they should have had this the other way around. I, I could change it, but I'm not doing that. That's how it's supposed to be. That's how I'm keeping it. Unless if Grand Stand to put it that way. That's something to think about. Let's hope that didn't happen. But, uh, yeah, there is there is that part. Let's turn them back this way. And, uh, that you know, you can... Let me just show this. Okay, I mean, this comes pretty much down there, like how this one does. I think this one's pants are just kind of baggy. They're kind of up there a little bit. I think that's why. This one. This one's pants, pants really are a little airy. It's weird. Because this one was certainly a used one. This one was not. This had the store batteries in it. It wasn't corroded or anything, thankfully. Kind of shocking, but it's good. It's cool that it wasn't. But you see this, like, it's a little hard to see there, like, around the outside of them, like the skin there. But this one, you can see it. You know? You can really see it. You can tell they decided to change that size there. I guess there's stuffing in there that's keeping it that big. Or the mechanism is actually that big. That actually could be it. But I don't know for sure. Not like I'm opening that up. You know. I don't want to be doing that. But. Anyway. And then, oh yeah, there's the top of the hair. So most of the Maybell's hair, it's kind of like that. Sometimes it's a tiny bit different, but really they all kind of vary with the hair, I guess. There's not a specific way. I think the majority of them kind of look like that, though. Don't know if that's the truth, but, you know. Anyway, uh, like I was saying with the audio, because... I think their audios are exactly the same. Maybe this one's a little clearer. Maybe that's a little clearer. I can't really decide on that. But. Um. This one has a higher pitch. And I think one of my old ones from 2008 sounded like that. But I'm telling you, these two are the exact same pitch. It's not really like you needed to hear this one anyway. But I got this out of the bin.
This was in a bin in there with that dumb coin. It was in the second, I'm gonna show you. It was in that bin. So I took everything on top of there, put it down here, took the stuff off the sides, put it down here, moved that bin down, I checked it first, moved that bin down, checked it, moved that. Thankfully, I didn't have to move those. It was in there. Luckily, it was kind of at the top. I actually did it on the live stream I did yesterday. So you can watch that. You can see me get it out of there. But I got that Maybell out of there just so I could do this, just because of the prototype. That's what made me get this out. I had to. I have not had it out, out for a while. Definitely a while. It's never been in this house in this room and actually be out, I think, from what I can remember. It's always been this one, which makes sense. Why would this one go in a bin? That'd be a little weird. It's a country pig, and it's me. Okay, we'll show this one, though. Uh, I, I guess I'll use my shirt for it. Yeah, I'll I'll use my shirt if I can if I can actually like get it in here. Now that you know what, it's gonna make the video look kind of stupid. I'll uh I'll press it with my hand. You see, I'm doing that old eye frogsy thing. See, okay. Here's this Maybell. Button is actually a little bit bad. Not really, but a little bit. And see, when it doesn't turn on there, I don't want to press it again. Telling you, one of my old ones sounded like this. See, that arm's a little. Eh. If it were to move and move kind of in between, like they're not, the arms are not as close together like this one, but they're not far like this. It's kind of like how I guess most of the Maybells would be. Yeah. Here it looks like the arm would move good, I guess, but. It's loose. It's very loose. You, I'm not moving that, but you can see it in the unboxing video. I didn't realize it was going to be loose. But it still manages to move. So that's good that it does. I think the audio does sound a little different. You know, by a little bit, it does, I would say. Look at that. Doesn't that look so nice? It does. It really does. These are the Maybells, and the video was not 40 minutes, but it was still, um, yeah. At least the last one isn't. I'm sorry. Like I said, I, I said I was sorry in advance. It's just Maybell. That's just how it is. Unfortunately, with the country pigs, that's how it is. Now I gotta put these batteries back in that dog, and then we gotta make the finale. But this was a Maybell, a, a Maybell comparison video. There won't be one better than it. All right, peace.